I learned from the Qualcomm surfer last week that you can actually get uh, five pig spawners in survival Minecraft all in one spot. So I wanted to see if I can make a pig farm from that. Uh, the challenge with pig spawners that you don't have with skeleton blaze spider spawners is that the pigs have to spawn on a block. Specifically, they have to spawn on a grass block. So you can't just have a big open area and, you know, have the pigs drop down into like some kind of water collection system. So I realized that one of those useless piston things I showed a few days ago uh, wasn't completely useless. So you can use it to just straight up retract the grass blocks out from under the pigs and then they fall down into, you know, wherever you want to send them off to. Um, <laughs> right now they're just being released into the river. Uh, <laughs> what's, <laughs> what's even funnier is... Uh, I did a time trial with um, this farm against this one over here. That was from a half hour. This farm is like the lowest tech you could build. It's no redstone or circuitry whatsoever. Uh, it's just pathfinding. The really funny part is this one actually got more more pork. So what is it like three, two or three stacks more, I think, in a half hour. So this thing is definitely just a novelty. You might be able to improve it if you like optimize the timing right now it's on every 11 seconds it'll retract the grass blocks one option i did explore was to have tripwire hooks so pretty much as soon as any pig spawns the floors will retract and those pigs will drop down and you could set it up so like when a pig appears only the floor near where the pig is retracts not the entire floor everywhere but I think setting that up is going to be a project for another week. If you do want to fiddle with this, I'll, I'll show you how you could build it up. But yeah, it's it's just straight up worse than the most basic pig of arm you could make. All right, so here's the uh, quadruple extenders I learned from a Cube Hamsters channel. And using honey blocks, you can obviously tile these. So we actually just have one torch, but uh, it, it powers all of these. And we can just make you know almost like a whole moving floor. I believe this actually would work fine if we only wanted to activate like the first three or something. Yeah, so you could selectively retract the floor using a device like this. And then for the second layer in there, you know, we have to put the pistons on top because there's not space underneath, but that's still pretty straightforward to do. And then, yeah, you put all these together, load them up with grass blocks, and you get pretty good coverage for these spawners here. And then a spawner can summon a pig up to four blocks, you know, out in all directions. In Java version, it's slightly different for bedrock. <laughs> they can summon a pig one block above at their own height or one block below. So because we have four spawners at this height, uh, we're kind of prioritizing this layer um, by giving these four spawners two floors on which they can spawn pigs. Uh, the top spawner, however, um, only has this top floor on which it can spawn pigs, so it's a little less efficient. Another weird trick I had to use was uh, I needed a block that would like keep the pigs from wandering out the backside but didn't turn grass into dirt and didn't stick to slime blocks. And I think the chest was the only, just about the only thing I could find that had that property. And then the 11 second clock for this thing is actually kind of interesting. So it uses torch burnout, but I learned that if you have torch burnout with a uh, repeater between the torch and the, you know, its own signal reaching back around to it, it'll actually just start itself up again. So I set up one of those like self restarting torch burnout clocks here and then I added a comparator. Uh, all that does is it turns the flashing redstone signal into a like just constant is on or is off signal. And then you just put a piston here with an observer and there you go. You get a pulse every about 10 or 11 seconds. All right, that's it for this time. Thanks for watching.